Aubrey O'Day claims Diddy tried to buy her silence with publishing rights. Former Donity Kane singer Aubrey O'Day claims that Sean Diddy Combs' move to turn over publishing rights to Bad Boy Records artists in 2023 was a way of buying their silence. I received the publishing deal. I know what it says. I know how much money it was giving me, O'Day says in a sneak peek of TMZ's new doc, TMZ Presence, The Downfall of Diddy, which comes out Sunday on Tubi. The singer, who did not sign the deal, says she was to be given $300.30 for a full release against all claims against Diddy and many other players. When asked by host Harvey Levin what she thought Diddy's motivation was in releasing the rights, she claims, I think you would probably be making moves to keep as many people quiet as possible. O'Day, 40, goes on to say it would not have made her financially whole again. It asked me specifically to stay silent and never speak poorly about a human. So then I realized, something really bad is coming, she concludes. A source with knowledge of the situation tells Page Six, Aubrey O'Day got her big break because Diddy and Bad Boy cast her in their show with her group, Donity Kane. Last year, when he reassigned his portion of the publishing to Bad Boy artists, an unprecedented move within the industry in which he did not have to do, not all artists signed an NDA. Reps for Diddy did not immediately return Page Six request for comment. In September 2023, Diddy, who founded Bad Boy Records in the 90s, made a rare move of reassigning his Bad Boy publishing rights back to all artists and writers on the label. It's just doing the right thing, Combs told Variety at the time. I think that we as an industry, and as a people, have to look in the mirror and make a shift forward. It's about evolving, leading by example and reforming an industry that needs it, in a world that needs reform.